Good morning, everyone. Well, it's like quarter 11, so I guess it's still morning, right? So, dog's going crazy, husband's crazy. But, busy day today. We're going to go have breakfast, I think, at the IHOP. And then we're going to go to a place called Lebanon. They're having a market thing today. And then I remember that um, in St. Louis today, they're actually having their Cinco de Mayo. So, we actually might go ahead and do that. Who knows? Let's just get our face on so I look awesome today. All right, so first we're going to spray our rose water on, which I got it right. Just calms the skin, makes it feel amazing. It smells great. It takes some of the red out. Um, it's great for sunburns. I mean, this stuff is just flipping awesome. Okay, so let that go in. And then I'm going to put my lotion on, which I use the night cream for right now um, because my skin is so dry. Um, so let's do that real quick. We're going to use palette two today. Um, I've used palette two a couple times. Um, so we'll see what happens, right? All right, so let's make sure I didn't forget anything. I already did my eyes right here this morning, right after I got out of the shower. So let's hydrate our skin. Did you guys do anything fun yesterday? Anything exciting? Put some lotion on. That'd be a quick face so I can get ready and get out the door. Um, it's left in today till like, uh, I don't know, it was like 8.30 I think, something like that. 9 o'clock? No, I think it was like 8.30. So, we should go down. We gotta make sure that we put our eye primer on today because we totally forgot that yesterday. So yeah. So yeah, we're gonna. I don't know. I don't know what we're gonna do. I know we talked about going to the market. It's called the market. It's in Lebanon. It's like a flea market slash. Um, they have music down there today. Um, like 60 plus vendors, which oh, I wish I'd have known because I would have been one of those 60 plus vendors, right? Let's make sure we do our lip scrub, collator. So remember, tomorrow is the last day that you can purchase a Door Her bundle. Um, and you have seen almost, almost every day, not almost, every day, I use this and this every single day. So you get this, this, and the mask for 74 bucks. So if I remember right, if I was doing the math, you're paying like a dollar for this. And it's usually, I think, $21. So it's a great deal. You can get it for your mom for Mother's Day, or you can get it for yourself. I bought myself, I think, two of them, just because... I use them every single day. Um, and then if somebody wants one, then I'll have an extra. So there's that. Um, but every day I use that rose water and I use the um, exfoliator. So good morning, good morning. Okay, so let's put our primers on. Harley, you're cracking me up, dude. You're upstairs. It's so funny. Okay, so you only need about that much. And then we're going to put it all over our face because we want it to sit for the five minutes. And it has plenty of time when I'm doing my eyes. So that's why I think I kind of, one, I put it on and then I do my eyes. And then it sets in and it does what it's supposed to do. Get in your fine lines and wrinkles and do its job. And it makes your skin so soft. And you can put it through your hair and all that fun stuff too. Um, but then it gives it time to set. And then I'm not worried about it, you know, when I have my foundation on already, getting it down to my foundation or messing up and all that fun jazz. Okay, so I'm going to put my eye primer on because I am going to be outside today. And I'm not really sure how the weather is today. It looks pretty. It looked pretty yesterday, but it was cold and windy. So, but I want my eye to stay on all day long. Coffee pots are going. So, there's our eye primer, right? I don't know what is on my face. Who knows? Who knows? And I don't have my towel. That's new. Oh, whatever. There's something on my eye. Okay. Alright, so now what we're going to do is let that sit for just a second. And I'm going to show you all. I forgot to put my little fun live. So Monday I should be back up in my makeup room, what I call my makeup room. Um, it's just a bedroom. <laughs> so here's palette two. 
We're going to do a couple of these colors today. Um, I think I'm going to do hopeful all over the lid. And then I think I'm going to go in with either um, probably cocky in the crease, but very, very light. Um, and maybe put some hopeless maybe on the lid. That's my plan. We'll see if that works. Okay. All right. So I'm going to take my deluxe brush. I really do have to find a towel. Hold on. had one yesterday and I walked it upstairs so okay now we're good just want to get whatever color might have been on there off there okay so like I said I'm gonna take hopeful which is kind of like a nude beige kind of color not beige but right here and I'm gonna put it all over my lid or all over my eye <clears throat> it's hard to sit in these bar chairs okay so I'm just gonna go over the whole entire lid I'm just going to add some more. And I've lost my little teeny tiny brush. I'm pretty upset about that. I don't know if I left it upstairs or what. Um, it's my little bitty brush that I'm, I do the, well now I've learned how to do the um, concealer up here at the top. I don't know what I've done with it. I tried to keep them all together, but since I pulled everything downstairs to get ready for my Fender Fair, it might have gotten lost in coming up and down the stairs. Who knows? I'll find it. Because then when you're just going over, then you don't have to worry if you go down into your, on your face or off, off your eye. Because then you take your makeup and just kind of sweep it away. Great idea. So I'm going over this a couple times because I do want it to... Cause it is kind of like a grayish, I don't know. It's, it's, it's gray, but it's like a matte color. Um, you can see it a little bit. Let me blend it in a little more. And this deluxe brush is awesome. It does really good with coverage. And then you don't worry when you're doing it, it goes down into here, you don't worry because your makeup, I said, like I said, is going to take care of that. So there's that. And then I'm going to take my, um, oh, I dropped my towel. I'm going to have a heck of a time today with this stupid towel, right? Um, then I'm going to take my um, crease brush and I'm going to take the... Uh, I'm going to take cocky and I'm going to put it in the um, crease. And it's this color right here. See? Almost dropped that too. Wow. It's going to be a day. So you don't need very much. Start out very little and then you can always add more. So you go like right on the tip right here of your eye. Kind of dot it. Okay? And then you're just going to do like a windshield wiper kind of thing. And you're not going to press real hard because you don't need to. See? It just goes right over that. So, I just want a little bit of color today. And I'm barely pressing on that. See? Very little. Good morning, everyone. It's still morning. So far, it's still morning. Okay, so like I said, I want very little on there. But I am going to put a little more on this corner right here. And I am going to pull it just a little bit over. So when I'm in my makeup room, you can really see what I'm doing. And I am going to blend that out. So let's not worry about that right this second. Okay? So I'm going to leave that like that just for right now. And then I'm going to go to the other side, and you're going to dot it, right? Get my hair out. And then you're just going to bring it over like a windshield wiper. So I always start out with very little, and then I add more. So that's what I do. So what are y'all doing today? Anything exciting? I mean, 
Yesterday, we ended up making uh, fajitas. Okay, we did not. Harley made fajitas, and then we um, we did have a couple margaritas. I wasn't going to, but I'm like, you know what? It's it's Cinco de Mayo. You cannot not have a margarita. So I went and bought really really good tequila. I always say tequila. And we had a couple margaritas. It was nice. I'm kind of bringing that down in like kind of a V shape on the corner. Okay, so I need to go up because it looks like the other side's a little up. So I'll tell you why we're doing our eyes and that primer has its has time to do its job, get into the fine lines and wrinkles and do what it's made to do. Make your skin soft. And it's gonna hold your makeup <clears throat> so much better than not having a primer. So I had a girl yesterday. Um, I'm gonna be posting some pictures of her. Um, she has really, really um, dark circles in her eyes, and she's kind of been like, mm, I don't know if I'm gonna do it or not. But she ended up taking the plunge and she got our kudos from last month um, the flawless floor and it is oh my gosh it, I'm gonna post the pictures of her soon I was in awe she looked I mean and you could just tell because you know when you're a woman things like that start to bother you you know like I have these dark circles and today I'm gonna use some concealer um, and I don't know if it's just I'm not sleeping well or what's going on but I'm gonna put it under here and it just bothers you. So when you find something that really just makes you feel so much better, whether it be makeup or whether it be whatever it is, um, I could tell from her first picture to her second picture how excited she was. And her text messages to me were just awesome. And it actually kind of brought a tear to my eye because I'm because of what I do and the people that get to try this stuff, it's like it just made me feel so good to make her feel good. So see, I'm tearing up now. And here comes Harley. He only did that because I'm on camera. <laughs> I'm just kidding. He only let me do that because he's on camera. <clears throat> so, we're just going to do this, which was, it's called cocky. And of course, you can hear Harley kind of giggle in the background. So, we're just kind of blending a little bit. This side always seems like I have something dark under it, and I don't. Crazy! Hey, I didn't, Harley. I was thinking if you wanted, we could do the downtown thing. There's a bunch of options today, so we need to kind of think about that. Okay. Did you get it? Oh. All right, so I just added a little more to my brush to kind of darken it up a little bit. Um, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take my... No, I don't want that one. How do things just go disappearing? I don't even go that far. <laughs> oh, there it is. It was upside down. Beanie probably did take it. That's our um, Boston terrorist. So I'm just going to take this brush, it's kind of a little fluffier, and I'm going to blend this out a little bit. You're giving her a bath right now? Oh, there's stuff in the sink. So see when you blend it, how much better compared to that to that it looks it's crazy, right? And it's just a little fluffy brush. You can get them at Walmart. I got it at the uh, BX, but you can get them at Walmart as well. Same brand, same everything, same package, everything. I think they come five in a pack, something like that.
eye does not want to work with me today, and I don't know why. Let's try our other brush. There we go. Did you add fun stuff? <laughs> Some had fun more than others. <laughs> All right, and then I'm just going to take... Um, I think I'm going to do Hopeless or Blissful. Do we want some bling or do we want just a little... Let me see what it looks like on my hand first. Yeah, we can do that. Let's do Hopeless. And I'm just going to put it um, right on my lid. So, see? Carly's fixing to give me a mad or a little Yorkie a bath. And then I'm just going to take... This is called our liner shader brush. And I'm just going to do Hopeful right here on the lid. Okay? Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. I think it's still morning. It's 11. It's still morning. So I'm just going to pat this like right here on the lid just to kind of give it a little more pizzazz. But I'm not looking for a lot of bling because I'm either going to be going to St. Louis just to hang out for a little while. Um, so see, just a little, just a little something, something. Or we're going to go to Lebanon. I don't know yet. It depends on how far we feel like traveling. That's a mad mad. Hi, mad mad. I need some makeup. <laughs> so you just kind of pat it on. Pat it on. Yeah, right? See, even Harley knows. You just pat it on. Insta wiper. Insta wiper. See, when I have him do my makeup again, he'll even know better next time. He says he will not. Here's the funny part is he doesn't know that probably later on tonight we're going to do the mask together. We're not getting our nails done. I don't feel like it. <clears throat> Alright, so then I'm going to take my brush again and I'm just going to kind of blend that and just like tap it a little bit. Just tap it. A little tappy tap. <laughs> and just kind of blend that in a little bit. But you don't want to touch too much because you don't want it to really go up in there. fun doing what I'm doing. I get to stay at home. I get to hang out. I get to, um, this is fun. This is a lot of fun. So, okay. Now I've got to decide if I want to do liquid foundation or if I want to do BB Claws. I think I'm just going to do liquid foundation today. Um, I'll show you guys. So this is it right here. Liquid foundation. It's an organza or organza when I want to feel cool. Right? And then you just shake. And then you need to make sure that you take everything out of the dopper because you want everything to mix together. Okay? So then you're going to take your foundation brush. And I'm going to do something a little different today. I don't know if I've done it before. I think I might have done it once other, one other time. So this foundation brush is pretty cool. Um, see, it looks like this. And I don't know if you can tell that it has like a hole in it like there. But you can put your concealer inside of that, okay? So that's what I'm going to do today. I'm going to take my Organza concealer, and I'm going to put it in with my foundation. So I can do... I was getting ready to shake the brush. That's funny. Um, that way, I can do it all at one time, okay? And then I'm going to take the Scarlet, and I'm going to highlight under my eye. So you just want to make sure that you get it shaken up really, really well, okay? So then, you're going to take and get some in your dopper, which looks like this. And you're going to take your brush, and you're just going to, I only start with three little dots, okay? Like so. And then I'm going to take my concealer, all right? And I'm going to put it in the middle of the brush, which it's going to take, when I show you how little it's going to take, I may have just put too much. When I show you, you're going to be like, what? See that little bitty dot in there? That's... It, it actually might be too much, okay? What I forgot to do was to pull my hair back. Okay, so we've given the primer plenty of time to um, get into the skin, put a barrier between my face and the makeup. So now we're going to do our liquid foundation and our um, concealer. So you just kind of want to dot it around. Like I said, I might have actually done too much. I want to get under these eyes. 
because for some reason, right now, I got some dark circles going on, and I'm not a fan. Okay, so we're just going to kind of share it about, go down your nose, all that. Remember not to go over your eyes, because you've done your, you've already done your eye makeup, you don't want to redo it. Okay, and then you do circle motions. Okay. under your eyes and then we're gonna go up and we're gonna take away any makeup that was on our cheek any eye makeup and I might have just got in there too much that's okay we can fix that so you always want to come down on your neck because you want it to all blend okay and I know it looks crazy right now but you're just going to Take your brush and do circular motions and get all up in there. Okay? And if you're using your BB cream like yesterday when I used my BB cream, um, I just, then after I got it all on, I went and used this brush to make sure I got the crease gone. Or put the, did my eyeshadow. So you just want to blend, blend, blend. I don't know. It looks crazy right now. You're going, oh, for the heavens of Pete. But you blend, blend, blend. And right now, I'm kind of in between colors. So what I can do, if I want is I can mix them together. This brush is awesome for going under your eyes. I mean, it just goes right under there. Look at that. It's freaking awesome. All right. I don't know what that is right there, but I'm gonna cover it up because I don't wanna look at it, whatever the heck it is. So see? Drop that towel again. So you want to go down on your neck to make sure everything is blending. Okay? So what I was saying is, is I'm a little kind of in between colors. One's too light, one's too dark. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to... And this, this um, dries to a powder finish. I want to say I got some of my, my, um, oh, what's it called? My exfoliator, my lip exfoliator in my brush. So I think it went on my top lip a little bit. So I had to wipe my lips off. I was like, what is going on? Uh-oh. It's a wind-up toy is what it is. So I just want to make sure that you get, see, I should have pulled my hair back. Get your ears as well. Let me just go down. Oh, she's a hot mess. See? She mm. loves that. She hates them. And she hates everybody that gives them to her for the minute until she forgets about it. So see? See those dark circles? Pretty much in there. It's still a little bit. I could have put some more concealer on them, but we're just going to let that go. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to put on... What am I going to do now? Put on my um, beachfront bronzer. So... Just kind of looks like this. It's called Sunset. I think it's the one of the lightest ones. I can't wait to go back to Charleston and get a freaking tan. Cancer. <laughs> get cancer. Yeah, that too. So then I just take the bronzer and I kind of go over my face a little bit to give myself some color. <laughs> I don't think I can move it to where you can see it. Can you see her in there? Yeah, she's going crazy. She gets a bath, she goes nuts. She looks like a wind-up toy. I'm trying to get the thing off. <laughs> Can't see her anymore. Well, there she is. A little bit. She's crazy. She's crazy. See? Like I said, it dries to a mat or a, um, yeah, just dries. Listen to him. It does. It does. It does. It does. 
So then I'll get tons of nobody watches my videos till they know Harley's on it. Yeah, I thought you wanted no. That's not decaf. It doesn't have caffeine. Yes, it does. It's got like a drop. No, it's just made different. I'm almost done. Well, I know I'm fine. All right, so then I'm gonna do blush, which is seductive. Okay. And this is the one I had to fix because I broke it. I did. And remember, they're very pigmented, so you do not need a lot. Probably not the whole work, right? Yeah, and then I found out after I did it, I could have used my rose water to do it. Ooh. Yep, didn't know that. So see, just a little bit of color. What? I'm going to get the dogs to barking like crazy and nobody's going to be able to hear me. Lord. Man, I wish I knew what I did with that teeny tiny brush. Ah, oh, I found it. It was upside down. Ah, one moment. And Riley's in the background laughing at me. Okay. What to do next, honey? What am I supposed to do now? You gotta do your mascara. <laughs> I mean, no, that's not next. Right. We're gonna do our eyebrows. And I'm just gonna do very little today because I don't want them really dark. So I'm just gonna kind of fill them in. I mean, just a smidge. Is it hot outside or cold or what? So see, just a little. The other day I really got in there. Is it? The purple one? It is. Last year when we bought it, I put pictures on Facebook, y'all. But last year when I bought it, it had some really pretty purple blooms on them. But then I brought it home. And I don't know if we shock the heck out of it or what, but it just was like, that forget you. Um, and then this year, I didn't think it was going to come back, and it did. And it is beautiful. I'll have to put some more. And then we had another plant that we put in just a pot, and it was pretty, it blooms like orange flowers. Is that right? They're orange? I think they're orange. Um, thought it was just one of those plants that you buy and you like for the moment. Come to find out, that sucker's coming back too. It's like, what? Okay, so I'm just going to go over these just a smidge. I know. So, like that. And then I think I'm going to take my pencil if I can find it. If not, I can. There it is. Found it. And I bought, um, I decided to go with the medium because this is dark. I want to see what medium looks like on me. Because I think this might be just a little smidge too dark. But we're going to see. So that should be here sometime next week. Uh, so any of my VIP peeps, if you're watching, I did get the stuff yesterday. Um, so I'm going to put it today, Put it, hopefully get it all put together today. If not, I will on Monday. Um, and get it all mailed out to y'all. So, be looking for a package soon. What? All right. I swear, one I always go up higher than the other one on this makeup deal. I'm just going to take this and kind of go up a little higher. And then, we're going to take our Scarlet Concealer. Is it in that? I don't know. I may have to put some concealer right there. Because that looks dark. Or maybe it's just a shadow. Who the heck even knows? Who knows? Who cares, right? Alright, so I'm going to take this. Scarlet is our lightest one that we have. Concealer. So I'm going to put a smidge on there. See? The smidge. And I'm going to take this little pencil. And I'm going to do... I'm going to highlight under my eyebrows. And then it'll dry to a powder finish as well. It just, it makes it look so much better. It's like, what? And I didn't do it under my eyes, I forgot. I'm not going to worry about it today. So then I'm going to wait a minute, and then I'm going to kind of blend it in. Um, I mean, I could still do under my eyes if I wanted to, but I just, not today. 
I was going to and then I've already added like blush and bronzer. Just can't remember everything. And it's actually not a lot. It's just, I think I'm kind of rushing because I know I want to get going. So then I'll blend this a little bit. Because you don't want any, you want it all to blend together. No idea what's going on. Can you see? And that looks higher than the other one. <laughs> what are you watching? Uh, all right, then I picked out some lipstick today and lip gloss, huh? No. So I already exfoliated my lips. I just had to take it off. Oh, and another thing you can do. That eye always looks darker, but I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Maybe. Oh, I'm just going to drop stuff everywhere. Maybe I can do a little darker over there. Just a smidge, right? Put some color. And I'm just going to blend that out. That looks a little better. Yeah. So you can also take your rose water and you can use it as a setting spray. Now I know we have a setting spray coming out through um, Unique, but I don't think it's out quite yet. Um, you guys almost made me forget to do my my um, mascara. So yesterday I only put the gel on. I was like, mm, that's all I'm doing. But today I'll do all of it. Okay. So I have to look in the mirror real quick. Get the eyelashes going. I like upstairs because you can definitely see when I'm doing something. Yep, I gotta use my mirror. Sorry, y'all. I guess I can try to use a regular mirror so you can see me do it. So you just wanna make sure that you coat them real well with your gel. And then you take your fibers, kind of wiggle them out. Some of them might come out, it's okay. Then you roll them on the back of your hand, like so. And then you go about mid-lash and then go up. Okay? I can hear my neighbors doing something. I don't know what they're doing. It's funny. So, you just do that and you're going to let them sit. Now, you can do the blow dryer effect, which I love that, but my blow dryer is upstairs. So, um, the blow dryer actually helps curl them and take any of the excess um, like um, fibers off, if there is any. Now... You're going to do the other eye, right? You want to make sure that you coat them well. And if you have the old um, mascara, the old, um, it's just called 3D Fiber Lashes. Um, this is the Fiber Lash Plus, which is an, um, amazing. Um, it goes on so silky smooth. If you have the old one and you're like, I'm not ever trying this, you just, you need to try this new one. Um, this new one is awesome. It goes on your lashes like silk. It also has the uplift serum in it. Um, I think that's right. Yeah, the uplift serum in it. Um, it helps your lashes grow and stay strong. So that's awesome as well. It's infused with that. So then you just take your fibers. And you don't have to with your fibers. You know like when you're putting your mascara on, you're like, you know, really getting in there. With the fibers, you don't have to do that. You barely have to touch your eyelashes to get them on there. So if that's another problem maybe you're having, um, just do it real light. All right, and then you're going to go back over them again with your um, gel because you want to lock in all those fibers to keep them on there. And that one is going crazy. Probably watching some Saturday Night Live thing. <laughs> So that's the cool thing about being able to work from home and do this is who cares what your family's doing in the background? It's your family. Then I can take this anywhere I want. I could go to, this is this job is gonna go with me to Charleston. I don't even want 
Oh, he's listening to our thing that we did last night for Cinco de Mayo with my Snapchat. Because if y'all don't know, I'm addicted to Snapchat. Harley loves it. Give it time. Somebody will tell him he has to use Snapchat. He'll use it. He will. He's going to get it. He's going to get He's going to do it. Huh? What? The Snapchat? It is. But I need to take more because they look a lot different now. You going to sleep? It has been quick so far. No, it's only been like a half hour. I know. It feels so long. Have you decided where we're going to eat? We don't, I don't think we have a Waffle House. So I'm just trying to fix this one eye because it's like driving me crazy. So if your mascara decides to clump on you or be stupid or your eyelashes are just being stupid, you can get one of these and they're metal, which is nice. I don't like the plastic ones. And you can just kind of go through them real quick. It's not always going to be perfect. Then I'm going to take some, I'm not going to do black, I'm going to do brown again. Um, I'm kind of digging doing brown eyeliner. I like this, that's blue. I don't know what I do with my brown eyeliner. It's probably upside down, I tend to do that. Put them back in here. Yep. Let's do prim. We'll do prim because I don't know where the other darker one is. Oh, here it is. Let's do proper. Okay. And I'm going to be buying myself a blender, blending bud that has like a sharp edge on it, like a cut. Um, so I don't touch my makeup when I'm trying to put my eyeliner on. So none of your oils and stuff get on your skin. Sure. Like so. Not bad. Might need a little... They're, I don't even know if they're in Charleston, are they? Waffle Houses? This is called Prodigal. Prodigal? Prodigal? I don't even know. So it's this color? That is not what I thought it was. It's pretty. It's just different. I wasn't ready for that. No. The 13th, I think. 14th? So there's that. It's like an orange, like a pinkish kind of coral. Mm -hmm. It's different. I'm going to take lunar lipstick, lip gloss, and line, and just put that over that. And then I'm going to take my rose water and I'm going to spray it on my face again to help set my makeup. Set it. And I think that's it because I'm not going to do the highlighting because I'm going to go throw some clothes on and get out the door because Harley's about ready to starve to death. So um, if you liked any of these um, products, you can go to lovethoselooks.com. Um, if you don't know who I am, I'm Miranda Ricketts and I am a pink presenter for Unique. And I just wanted to kind of hang out with y'all and see what y'all thought. So comments below if you what you thought, and I will talk to y'all soon. So um, stay beautiful and have a great rest of your weekend. Bye.